Supreme Court has reserved its judgment in the diesel ban case for vehicles with engines bigger than 2,000 cc. The government had argued today that the levy of offsets on diesel vehicles is a legislative process and courts should not intervene. Ashmit Kumar, who was in the courtroom when the arguments were going on, filed this report earlier. Right, so after lengthy arguments, the Apex Court has finally concluded the hearing and reserved its judgment on whether or not to lift the diesel ban. Now, there were essentially two questions that were being dwelled on. Number one was, of course, the ban, whether or not to lift it. The second was when uh, it was uh, that if the ban is lifted, should that be replaced by a pollution cess, a pollution levy on diesel vehicles? Now, the government today opened the arguments, came out all guns blazing. In fact, the Attorney General, taking a cue from none other than the Finance Minister, Arun Jaitley, began the arguments by saying that uh, the matter of uh, cess would be, uh, in fact, a matter of taxation that would fall in the domain of the legislature, that the courts uh, cannot exercise jurisdiction in this space, uh, that this is a matter that should be confined exclusively to the legislature, that the government wants to take the lead, that it would be inappropriate for the courts uh, to levy such a cess as far as diesel vehicles are concerned. Uh, so drawing very clear lines there, the Attorney General, the government also clarified that this is a sector which has seen a significant bit of investment. Uh, there it's created millions of jobs and that any such move uh, would, would in fact jeopardize and hurt the sector. And finally, they argued that diesel vehicles are already are already heavily taxed and that there's no room for an ad additional cess. Uh, the car makers on their part expectedly came out in, in, in defense of the government's position. Uh, they argued that uh, the car be cars being manufactured are BS4 compliant, they're less, they emit less pollution. Uh, they also argued that uh, BS6 norms have already been advanced, that they've made significant investments in the space, uh, that there is no reason uh, for additional taxation, no grounds made out for additional tax uh, taxes being levied on diesel vehicles. Now this of course was one side of the arguments the petitioners on their part continued uh, to seek for a greater action by uh, a greater act action uh, by the apex court seeking as much as a 20 percent cess as far as diesel vehicles are concerned so all questions being considered right now the supreme court on their part making its position clear that it needs to in fact be proactive as far as the environment issue is concerned and that it will take a measured call that it does not want to be impulsive as far as this decision is concerned so clearly the big decision is now awaited from the apex court back to you